It's my first video on this channel. I want to tell you about myself, my life and my move to London. I'm learning English, that's why I don't speak well. I was born in a small closest military town in Russia and always felt that it was the country where I wanted to live. I entered the Stiglitz Art Academy and after that I decided that I wanted to focus only on contemporary art and then move to England. It seemed like an unreal dream. I understood that I needed to create a good portfolio, have a solo exhibition. I wouldn't be able to live soon, but a lot happened that showing, that waiting, was no longer an option. There was no more work and art was still there, but it all seemed silly and unnecessary. Then my partner and I decided that it was time to leave and we began to prepare for it. Our careers were put on hold. I prepared the evidence and only sent it in 2023. After two months, I received an endorsement from the Art Council with a positive response. My partner also applied and received the same answer on the same day. Then we started preparing to move. It was strange because you couldn't pay visa fees from Russia, you couldn't pay for accommodation, so many people helped us from other countries. And they wouldn't let us, but I thought, wouldn't let us out of the country. Я не понимаю, а? Я знаю, и что? Я не смогла это записать. Я прочитала эту фразу. On the day of departure, we were very afraid that they wouldn't let us out of the country as anything can happen now and then that and then <laughs> and then the we were stopped at customs they checked how much money we were carrying and then they let us go and so our new life began
For about a week, we tried to open one account, get a SIM card and find an apartment. It took a long time because Russian cards are prohibited everywhere. And people don't want to open accounts for people from Russia. Since there is a housing crisis in London, landlords don't want to rent out unless there is a job, British bank statements and recommendations. We were denied everywhere immediately. But on the 10th day, we found the studio where we are now living. What's happening now? Every day we do everything to find a job. I start recreating art, working on projects and graphics, applying for contests and open calls. Maxim teaches drawing and painting and looks for new students. Also, we do hand painting murals. In a couple of months of living here, I attended exhibitions, two fairs, visited several museums, cycled a lot, searched for vintage clothes, bought a dress for a new project and learned to enjoy life again. Thank you for watching. If you want me to tell more about something, right? I'm just starting and your support will be appreciated. You can leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to help financially, you can leave a donation for an English tutor and make the video with Google Translate. Or you can buy my work. Thank you. See you in the next video. There I will show how my artwork was created.